Wondering how to remove background in Canva? In this Canva tutorial, you'll learn Canva tips and tricks on how to remove your background in Canva, which is a Canva Pro exclusive feature. So let's get right into this how to use Canva background remover tutorial so that you can create a Canva transparent background using the auto background remove feature. The remove image background feature is available to Canva Pro, Canva for Enterprise, Canva for Education, and Canva for Nonprofits users. If you don't have one of these Canva plans yet, just click on the link in the description box below to sign up for free. To remove the background of an image in Canva, after you've logged in to your Canva account, Either open up an existing Canva design you want to remove the background of, or create a new Canva design from scratch. To open up an existing document in Canva, click on Your Projects from the left-hand side panel, on Designs up top, and then locate the design you want to remove the background in Canva of. For guidance on how to create a new Canva design from scratch, make sure to check out my Canva Tutorials playlist, which is full of step-by-step -step Canva tutorials. I'm going to open up this existing Canva design of a cute dog. To remove the background of this image using the Auto Background Remove feature in Canva, click on the image and then on Edit Image from the white panel up top. From the side panel that opens up, Click on the Background Remover feature to remove the background of your image with one click. Wait for the background removal to be processed. Once your image's background has been removed, use the Erase and Restore brushes if you so wish to fine-tune the result. As the name implies, the Erase brush removes extra parts of your image and the Restore brush brings those parts back. You can increase or decrease the brush size to make it easier for you to fine-tune your image with a removed background. And you can click on the Show Original Image box to compare the image with and without the background removed. Another cool thing you can do is resize and reposition this dog within the transparent background. All you have to do is double click on it, use the circular handles around it to make it bigger or smaller, click and drag to reposition it, and once you've finished making edits, click on Done from the white panel up top. If you wish to make further edits to this design, Right-click on your image, and then click on Detach Image from Background at the bottom. You can either leave the removed background as is, or click on Backgrounds from the left-hand side panel to change the background to another color. Click on the Color Picker from the white panel up top to customize even further that color or to add your own brand colors as the background, or even choose one of the Canva background options to add, such as landscapes, patterns, gradients, abstract, food, textures, flowers, nature, or all. Since I'm a Canva Pro user, which you can try out for free by clicking on the link in the description box below, I can add my own brand kit with my brand colors to Canva. If you want to know how to customize those, make sure to watch my video on what is a Canva brand kit and how to customize a Canva Pro brand kit. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. I'm going to leave my removed background as white to show you something else you can do when removing the background of an image in Canva. Another thing you can do is click on another image from your uploads or from Canva's photo library, which has a background, to add it to your Canva design 
and follow the same process as before to remove its background. All you have to do is click on the image and then on Edit Image from the white panel up top. From the side panel that opens up, click on the Background Removal feature to remove the background of your image with one click. Wait for the background removal to be processed. If you wish, use the Erase and Restore brushes to fine-tune the results and double-click on the second image you just removed the background of to resize and reposition it. And then click on Done from the panel up top. Repeat the same process for any other image you wish to remove the background of. You can remove backgrounds from Canva images and from your uploads with a daily use limit of 500. Feel free to edit any other existing elements on this Canva design with a removed background or to add new ones from the options on the left-hand side panel. For an entire walkthrough of all of the available elements in Canva that you can add to your Canva design, make sure to watch my video on how to use Canva. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. Once you're done removing the background of your image in Canva, rename your Canva design up top, such as to Image with Background Removed, and then click on the Download button. To save this image so that it's truly without a background, not even with white as the background color, make sure that you select PNG as the file type and then click on this Transparent Background box. As the little crown denotes, Transparent Backgrounds in Canva are a Canva Pro feature, which you can try out for free by clicking on the link in the description box below. Once you have set all of your download settings, click on the Downloads button to save your Canva design with a removed background to your computer. Once the design has been saved, you can drag it into Canva again to add it to your Uploads folder. As you can see, the Canva design indeed has no background, and you can now use it on your other Canva designs if you wish, without disturbing the other elements within it. You can also remove the background in Canva of an image or of an upload in the Canva app. To do so, open up the Canva app on your phone, and just as before, either open up on an existing Canva design you want to remove the background of, or create a new Canva design from scratch. I'm going to open up the same original design we were working on by clicking on Your Projects at the bottom, on Designs, and then on the Canva design I wish to remove the background of. Click on the image, and then on Effects at the bottom. Click on BG Remover, and wait for the background removal to be processed. Just as before, you can double-click on your design to open up the Crop feature, which allows you to resize and reposition it. And once you're done doing so, click on Done on the bottom right-hand side. Feel free to make any other edits to this image with a removed background or to add any other elements from the options that appear at the bottom. To save this image with a removed background on the Canva app, click on the upwards pointing arrow up top and then click on Download. If you wish to save the image with a transparent background, make sure that PNG is selected as the file type and that you click this Transparent Background box. Then all you have to do is click on the Downloads button at the bottom to save the image with a removed background to your phone. For an entire walkthrough of everything that you can do with the Canva app, make sure to watch my video on how to use the Canva app. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. If you're serious about removing the background of an image in Canva, Make sure to sign up for a free Canva account by clicking on the link in the description box below, check out our Canva Tutorials playlist for even more Canva tips and tricks, 
as well as your free cheat sheet with the brilliant tools that you should use below this video to learn more about how to save time and boost your productivity in your online business. Leave a comment below and let me know where you'll be using the transparent background image that you created in Canva. If you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so that you can navigate the tech side of online business with ease. And stay tuned for our next video, which is about how to add shadows in Canva. As you wait for my next video to go live, check out these two videos I have right here, and I'll see you in my next video.